Hola, me amo Kelly. <laughs> we are in Cabo, Mexico. Our Airbnb is right there. There's a terrible noise behind me right now, but we are walking in downtown Cabo area where the big marina is. We're gonna get some lunch, maybe some coffee, as you guys already know, and we're just gonna explore. Now, about five days ago, I saw some ladies, they had some fish tanks and they were doing pedicures. So I'm hoping they're still there because if so, I'm definitely gonna stick my feet in a fish tank. Look how pretty the water is in the mountains. We are definitely not in Florida anymore. You guys like my purse? I got it at the gas station <laughs> because I forgot to bring a bag for if we walk around. And Gabe doesn't like putting anything in his one pocket, so. I busted out my lucky shorts for today. The lucky shorts. But the shorts you guys, Blue Gabe put me on my dream fish here in Cabo, Mexico. Snapper. Ooh. Wow, that's a really pretty snapper. Good size too. Whoa, look at that monster. We didn't even have to get on the panga yesterday. We could have spearfished right in the marina. Talking about yesterday, Blue Gabe and myself went with Captain Eron and we went spearfishing in the surge against these huge rocks and these cliffs here in Cabo. The water was a little chalky just because with the surge it like kind of brings up the sand a little bit. But I'm gonna show you guys some underwater footage of us spearfishing yesterday.
fish. <laughs> oh boy. All right, Gabe's trying to get one too. Babe, you know what's happening in Tampa right now? What? With the red tide. I clean your feet, okay? Okay. She has to clean my feet first. You might cause a red tide in there. No, my feet are clean. But he's gonna do it too. 
There's things living under there, like lobster maybe. That's nail polish. I guess all the feet lovers will appreciate that little clip show there. <laughs> I think this I think this might be the best thing that we've done in Mexico so far. Wait till she turns the big ones loose in there with the big teeth. Yeah, right? Oh my gosh. I want one of these. How cool. All right. Listen, you have to do it too. That one just swam between your toes. Wait, let me open my toes. They gotta get in between the toes. Oh my gosh. This literally makes my whole day right here. All right. Babe, your turn. I don't want to see. Yes, stick your feet. Come on. Do it for the fans. <laughs> Come on. You guys, I'm making Blue Gabe get a fish pedicure right now. Oh! <laughs> I might take a nap. It's nice. We got some shade. Oh, that Sorry. tickles. <laughs> They're literally piranhas without teeth. That definitely feels weird. Doesn't my, it? My mom would like this. Right? This is amazing. It's so cool. I got some big fish in mine. Look at oh man. It feels like bubbles. I don't know, but I think my screen is up dirty. It does. That's a that's actually a better explanation. It feels like a bunch of like bubbles are coming up on your feet. We have an audience right now. <laughs> they are. I don't know if I should make this a fish cleaning foot video or spear fishing video. Like this is probably one of the best things I've ever done in my life. I'm not gonna lie. They like getting in the cracks. Yeah, they do. I think when I get back to the States, I'm gonna order a bunch of these fish. I love them. Dude, Luke and Jake, they I don't know what they would think about this. Luke would be dying laughing right now. <laughs> it does tickle your feet. So they're just gently exfoliating the dead skin cells off of your feet. so soft right now. Like seriously, not lying. So after our fish pedicure, we were at a sushi restaurant and I asked our captain, Eron, yesterday that if all the sushi places in Cabo, Mexico get the fish from Cabo and he said that they do. So it's really cool that they get their fish locally instead of imported. Just from what I hear. That looks good. Yeah, it does. It looks like the the eggs from the plecos. Tastes good. 
I see a little baby in there swimming. These are, I think, bonita flakes. No, seaweed, seaweed. The tuna is actually the right color. It is, the tuna is the right color. So we just got done with eating and we have stickers for our YouTube channels and if you guys know I like to put my sticker in like marina areas that I've been to because it kind of like marks my territory. <laughs> so we found a pole here with other people's stickers on it. Is it sort of like peeing on the fence post? It is, <laughs> but a little more sanitary. trash can right here how convenient all right blue gabe where do you want yours surprise me all right blue game kelly young officially made it to cabo mexico so right now we have our cooler of fish the fish that we were spearing in this video uh, we kept calling them pomfret, but they're not pomfret. They're a type of pompano, and this is how you spell it. Gaff top sail pompano. Not sure how you say it. Gaff top sail? <laughs> I don't know. But we have them in this cooler, and we're going to take them to this restaurant called La Chetta. I might be butchering that too. Um, and they're going to cook it for us. It's a catch and cook restaurant. So super excited. We're walking down the dock right now, and we're going to go fly the drone and See if we can't get some pretty shots of Cabo San Lucas. So before we go into the restaurant, there's probably gonna be music playing, so I don't know how much I will film, but I did gut and gill these little pompano here and i've actually never eaten pompano i caught one once accidentally i was fishing for pinfish for bait and i ended up giving it to jazzy which is my dog because i don't know i just didn't feel like eating it so this is my first time eating a type of pompano fish are they there? are very good by the way are they <laughs> i guess well african pompano is a massive pompano but i feel like it's a little bit different so we are at dinner reading YouTube comments, and look at this orange juice I just got. I figured it needed its own appearance in this video because it looks so beautiful. I thought that was me. I deserve my own appearance in this video for being so beautiful. So good. Oh my god. Oh my god. That looks so cool. <laughs> Gracias. I think they forget some of the mashed potatoes back in the kitchen. <laughs> yeah, they, maybe not enough. Not enough. Thank you. Uh, this is the frying, frying, frying. Perfect. Yes. Enjoy it. Thank you. It's way hot right now. This is the grill. Alright you guys, we're going to sit down and enjoy this beautiful dinner here in Cabo, Mexico. It's our last night here. We're flying back to Florida tomorrow morning. But for right now, thanks for watching. Be sure to hit the thumbs up, hit the subscribe button, and I'll see y'all next time. See ya!